Hi everybody, welcome back to Lori Craves. So today I'm really craving for some tteokbokki, but I'm not really prepared to go all out and make a meal. So I actually bought this thing at H Mart that I'm really, really excited to try. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Spicy tteokbokki! I am so so excited to try this. Let's see how this goes. Struggling. Packaging is really nice. Wow, that's a lot of ingredients. It says three minutes and there's a fork included. Oh, you get like a little packet of tteok. It actually feels pretty legit. And then you have a packet of sauce. And a little fork! There is no tear on this thing. Oh, got it. This is why my teeth are so bad. Woohoo! Do not eat. The rice cake is really interesting. It feels real. The topoki sauce. Ooh. Oh, not as red as I thought it would be, actually. How much water do you Oh, there's a line. Whoa, get that little girl. Pop this into my itty bitty microwave that I got from a good friend. Should I lit it or should I not? Yeah, let's cap it. Okay, bye. Three minutes. I can't wait. My expectations are pretty high right now. I'm excited. 10 more seconds. <gasps> Oh my god, I am so glad I put a lid on it because look at this. I would have to clean that all up. Mm, came out like a bit watery. Is this supposed to be like that? Man, were my expectations too high? My expectations are pretty high right now. Romantic lunch time. <laughs> this is so exciting! I got my metal spoon, I mean, Fork. Uh, go in there and mix it up. I've been craving for tteokbokki for a really long time. So this is really, really exciting for me. This is how it looks. Mm. Kind of underwhelming. Let's try it. Mm. Okay. The texture is surprisingly good. It's like nice and chewy and soft. Definitely cannot be compared to any brush. I actually... Yeah, this would definitely help satisfy my cravings if I was craving tteokbokki and didn't want to cook it. It surprisingly soaked up the sauce pretty well. The sauce is fairly spicy, but not unbearable. Now we're gonna jazz it up. Oh, where did you come from, bowl of corn? I'm just gonna scoop maybe like... Ah, who am I kidding? Because <laughs> corn makes everything better. <laughs> Yum! Cheese! Mix this up. So I know more rice cake. <laughs> Just gonna transfer this onto a nice plate. Gotta make sure I get all the corn. No corn left behind! Oh yes. At this point, I might as well just have made dopoki. <laughs> get in there. Put that cheese on. No cover. Living life on the edge. Bye! Oh, it's really bubbling. Holy moly. Um, why did I get such a shallow bow? Alright, let me feel. Yep, definitely hot. Couldn't tell it was something instant, right? You know what? I'm just gonna, gonna suck it up. Yes, I made it! <laughs> Ooh, look at that! Wait, this is a better angle. No, it just looks like a blob. But like, what is dopoki without an egg? Oh, don't look at that. The bottom part didn't get marinated, but... And your dopoki is ready to be devoured. Yum nom nom. Corn and cheese will make anything taste good. Mm. <laughs> the corn seriously makes such a huge difference. Adds a little bit of texture and the cheesiness makes you forget about the sodium. Mm. Oh my god. 
It was so good with the corn. And it really didn't take that much time because if you think about it, if I had mixed in the corn in the beginning with the cheese and everything, it would still have taken just like three minutes because it took a full three minutes to melt the cheese. It's only been marinated for a day. Dude, this egg though, perfectly soft boiled. Don't drop, don't drop, don't drop. It's so good. Craving satisfied. Mm. I think I only bought this for like maybe like a dollar fifty to two dollars, maybe three. Definitely worth it. It satisfies those like double cravings that you might have randomly and don't have the ingredients for. Oh, I should have cut up some fish cakes. I'm gonna go finish this. So. Like, subscribe, notifications, everything. It's the first time I'm making this type of video, so let me know if this type of on-the-go style works for you. Enjoy! <laughs> it looks so nasty, but whatever. <laughs> Alright, bye! I just realized that I forgot to put kimchi. That was the one thing I told myself that I had to put in on top of corn because it'll make it so delicious. If you put kimchi in yours, let me know how it tastes down in the comments below. I'm sure it's gonna taste amazing. Made all the adjustments. Got the corn. And I added fish cake. Oh, I should have added kimchi. Why didn't I add kimchi?